Hello, so <laughs> I literally hate myself right now. I've just sat down to it. Right, I'm not even gonna get into that yet. So I need to explain something. Firstly, I didn't get to upload a video last week because I left my hard drive and everything at my mum's house and I was at my dad's. I just looked on my laptop and put my SD card in and realized that the vlog clip is missing. I've managed to delete it. Sorry, got a bit distracted, so I'm back. Um, Donovan came in and I was chatting to them for ages. Anyway, back to talking about what happened. So, I, I, the only bit I have left is from Friday onwards. So, I am going to put that at the start of this weekly vlog. So, this is going to be weekly vlogs 10 and 11. Um, but I'm actually really annoyed that I've lost it because, well, for obvious reasons. But as well, that weekly vlog was the one that if you follow me on Twitter, you'll know I said I weren't sure if I was going to upload. Because it weren't the most positive weekly vlog ever. A lot stuff happened in it and i don't know maybe maybe there's a good reason it was deleted i don't know i kind of wanted to upload it because it does kind of shows you guys my life definitely is not perfect a lot of stuff happened especially at the beginning of the week a lot of stuff went wrong just so much stuff was going on and i was just trying to explain that you shouldn't ever take anything for granted and my life isn't perfect stuff happens is what it is um but yeah just the message was to never kind of take anything for granted Anyway, now I've got to do some other explaining because I wasn't going to get questions on this. Another disaster happened in that week that I vlogged. Um, so I went to get my second piercings done. And long and short of the story, because I cannot be bothered to explain it all over again. So I explained it in that and now that's gone. The woman who pierced this ear, they didn't both at the same time, pierced it in the wrong place. She got up and walked out and never told me and left and never came back to apologise. Um... I now have two piercings in one ear and one in this ear because I had to take this one out. So right before Christmas, this one will be getting re-pierced so like I can get it done again. I've just got to leave it because I don't want to risk my ear lobe tearing. Um, so yeah, I have two earrings in this ear, one in this ear. It's great. Please don't judge me. It looks ridiculous. Um, well, I think it does. But yeah, anyway, that disaster happened as well because this ear swelled up. I think it got infected and i had to get the earring out anyway but i was like okay i really need to get this thing out the earring back got stuck on the earring i was having like full-on meltdown like i cannot get this earring out this was a couple of days after i got it pierced and then it resulted in my dad ripping it out with pliers it was great so <laughs> explaining done because otherwise i'd get questions why are you wearing two earrings in one ear and one in the other i ask myself the same thing every day one in a good week probably best that that doesn't get uploaded to youtube because it was not very positive so yeah enjoy it bye <laughs> disaster just really quickly wanted to jump in and say this because i said this at the start of the weekly vlog that i had deleted and i forgot to say this when i filmed that intro i basically have a code which is on the screen now it's for la la lab you can use it on their app website whatever um they have such good christmas presents on there like photos calendars so many different gifts and stuff so i'd really recommend checking it out they have like the stuff on there is so nice i've ordered from there before i'm really like i love their stuff i think it's such a cool idea and such like a good app if you use my code you get five pound off your first order and if you've already ordered from them you could always just like make a new account under your mum's email address or your like sister's email address or something and then get another five pound off so if you ordered something that was five pounds that thing would basically be free so i thought i'd just say it now because it's quite a cool christmas present idea if you want to use that code on the screen there, copy and paste that at the checkout and it will apply your £5 discount. So yeah, enjoy the rest of the video. Hello, so it is Friday, thank God. Um, weekend tomorrow, which I could not be, oh, what have I done there? I could not be looking forward to the weekend more, although I probably shouldn't be looking forward to the weekend actually because I'm working more weekend, which is fine. But it means I don't have any time to do schoolwork and I've got a lot to do, so... Probably should be a little bit concerned about that. Anyway, I haven't spoke to you yet today. Finished early today, which is good. Wasn't very productive when I come in though, when I should have been. Anyway, we went, we came back here, went for Nando's this evening for some food, obviously. Um, <laughs> and went with mum, got dinner. Then we had to go Matalan because I ordered my, you know, I got like a couple weeks back that Christmas delivery. I've only just picked it up. So I'm going to show you that in a second um and we went to sainsbury's to get some food and stuff and me and Finn ended up looking at loads of crap in there because why not that's what you do on a friday night apparently my camera is about to die which is so not helpful wow this lighting is terrible i can't oh god this just is not look at that light right ignore the terrible lighting situation i've got going on so 
other day from the card factory basically our wrapping paper theme we've never done this before but i thought why not we're gonna have a wrapping paper theme this year apparently <laughs> we have a gold and red themed tree usually so i'm going for a gold and red and brown paper themed wrapping paper so i got these two by the way i haven't dad's bought this um well i bought it out of dad and fee's money and they would not make me buy all the wrapping paper for everyone so the first wrapping paper is this red one it's so nice it's got like all different bits and bobs written on it to do with Christmas. This is literally, can you understand like how long that wrapping paper is? It was £1.49 from Card Factory. And also to go with the red themed, it's like a brown paper, it's not focusing, like a brown paper one with like metallic red reindeers and snowflakes and stuff on it. And that was 99p also from the Card Factory. Right, how do I get into this? Okay, first thing in the box, tags. I've got two of these apparently. Tags with like gold metallic stripes and polka dots on. They were two pounds each. They had like a free, I don't know if they still do, but they had like a free for two thing on all the Christmas wrapping stuff. So it made everything so much cheaper. Also, I thought Dad and Fee could put these on my presents. Um, got some <laughs> I got some bows. I'm joking, they can do whatever they want with them. Um, I got some bows. They're like a uh, hessian, is it? I don't really know they look like so they're like a brown kind of hessian go with the brown paper and gold theme with silver glitter on they're very pretty they were two pounds as well so we got them um then they've actually wrapped this up so well then i got some ribbon to go on the present again this is red so one of them says like have a jolly christmas merry christmas a little like one with holly leaves on um they look like so they were three pounds you get three rolls it looks so nice going around like the brown paper presents we also have an actual roll of brown paper like a massive one that we use so that's i'm going to use that and wrap some of them in that and tie some like ribbon and stuff around there i love wrapping up christmas presents weird if i do then for the wrapping paper i love this wrapping paper I'm literally obsessed so i've got two got two of these rolls they're brown paper with gold um polka dots on you could kind of use these for birthday if you wanted to they were two pound fifty each crikey did not know they were that expensive there's quite a lot on there though so yeah i've got them and also the exact same like brown paper thing but with like reindeers or whatever on i don't know what they are deers something like that again two pound fifty and that was all three for two so i was like why not so that is our wrapping paper this year I feel like it goes nice and i feel like they always look better once the presents are actually wrapped up in them brown paper red and gold and then obviously i've got all the little ribbon and stuff to go with it this order i know i've ordered a lot but it honestly did not come to much like it worked out quite cheap and oh i got another of that ribbon another pack of that did not know i got two of them um I've got some Christmas presents for people in this, but I can't show them. They will be in a video at some point though. And then the other thing I got is a set of three brown bags with gold on it that obviously goes with this wrapping paper. And so you have three in there, a big, a small, and a medium. Um, that was £3.50, which is quite a lot, but is really nice. I think all of this came to 20 something pounds. But there was two presents in that as well because when i done it i think i got a deal that i got five pounds off or something as well something like that but it all came to like not a lot of money okay so it's 14 days i think till we put our christmas decorations up how exciting um and 37 days oh my god 37 days till christmas i'm literally Oh my gosh, that's crazy. That's insane. Other the presents now. Also, I am going to film one of those, um, what I got other people for Christmas videos because we bought more Christmas presents today, actually. We got a couple in Sainsbury's. Um, I, re I really want to film one of them. So I am going to do that. So keep on the lookout. Make sure you subscribe. Um, I've had a bit of a better today. I've had a bit of a better day today. Oh, also, earring. So, update. Yesterday, all throughout school, my ear really, really hurt. And it was really, really sore, really tender. And when I got home, I thought it looked a little bit red and a bit not right. Left it a little while. Anyway, this is the dodgy ear, by the way. The dodgy earring. Left it. Um, 
and then I looked in the mirror and it was really swollen. I know she pissed in the wrong place, but it shouldn't have been swollen. It shouldn't have been hurting. Anyway, in the end, I'm not kidding you, we resulted to pliers. Dad had to put pliers on the back of my earring, hold the front. What a foul of a vlog for today. Oh, I know it didn't charge his camera battery. It's gonna die, isn't it? Anyway, had work today. Work was really good. Um, and then Gwenda came over for dinner and I've been doing schoolwork and I've been doing it for ages and it's maths and I've not got very far. But I'm not gonna stress. So I feel like it's best to, it's best best stuff, better, best, better that I get up earlier, try and do some work in the morning or something. Hello and welcome back to what I think is the eleventh weekly vlog. It's going like time is going so freaking quick. I went after school today. Oh, before I do that. It's actually now Tuesday because I forgot to vlog yesterday and it went till last night when I was getting into bed. I realised I hadn't started the weekly vlog and I also hadn't ended the one, last one. So here we are doing it now. Now I was actually going to do a clothing haul, right? You know what I've been saying for ages, I'm going to do one. I don't know if I will now to be honest, so I'm not really sure. So maybe I'll just show you this now. Um, I went um, into town after school and picked this all up. This is from, it's actually from Next. It's from Lipsy. So, like, I got it on the next website, but it's from Lipsy. Yeah, if that makes sense. Um, so, this, I didn't realise. Next have a clearance section on their website. I never go on Next. I was ordering a Christmas present on there. And then I stumbled across the clearance section, which isn't where I got the Christmas present from. I just stumbled across it and I looked. And I found this top, which I really liked. So, this was, it's from Lipsy. It was originally £28. And I got it for £14. So, half price, which I think is so good. Um, and, like, £14 for this top. Like, it's a really nice top. So, it's basically, hold on, I should probably do the buttons up on the front. It would make more sense when I show it to you. Don't know how to show you this. It's like this i'm not sure for some reason i have this thing about like checkered shirts i don't feel like they suit me i'm not sure what it is like shirts with like collars on i don't know i feel like they don't suit me i'm not really sure but i do quite like this so i'm just gonna keep it and go go with it i mean it was 14 pounds so it's like it'd be stupid not to got a little thank you card for della which is mine and my mum's friend who took us out for afternoon tea um as my birthday present yeah got a thank you card for her so i'll give that to her probably later on tonight i have lost my motivation i lost it a few weeks ago if i'm honest like a couple weeks ago that like every day i just come in and i just don't want to do anything so today i'm going to try and make that change however it's already 10 past four so i've come in and i've not done anything and i left school at two <sighs> so i've just got to um dad's and my parcel came today which i thought i ordered no that's such a stupid thing to say i ordered um but i got an email in school today saying that it had been delivered to the post office and i was like oh for god's sake and i've got to go all the way to the post office to go and get it and you can't get it until after 24 and i was just like oh nightmare it's always such pain when that happens anyway came home it was here so i didn't know i lived at a post office if i'm honest i wanted to get mum this as a little it's not really that little as a present um because I thought it would give her something to look forward to throughout December and give her something to look forward to every day leading up till Christmas. Um, as, yeah, life isn't perfect at the minute. Um, so I just thought this would make her smile. So I decided to get her a beauty advent calendar. I have one from You Beauty, as you would have seen. I chose this one for her because I wanted one that was more like skincare stuff because I feel like she'd use that more. I weren't really sure. I don't know. So I got her this. It's by the body shop. It's the it's the purple one. There's like three on the website. I got the purple one. Um so yeah, it's a 24 days of well, it says uh, 24 days of beauty advent calendar. Um so yes, yeah, how exciting. It's very big. I'm very excited to give it to her. I'm not gonna make you jump. What do you think it is? I don't know. I'm not gonna make you jump. Okay. Oh, you open out your hands. Oh my gosh, I've really got out of the whole swing of the, what is on my hair? The, 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 what, why am I going with this? I've really got out of the swing of the whole vlogging thing. Anyway, I've come upstairs because I need to hole punch this because this is my English homework due for tomorrow and I haven't done it. Not to hole punch a piece of paper. We actually have to like read and annotate it too. This is just quality vlog clip, this is. I don't know why I keep thinking it's Thursday today, but I do. And it's kind of annoying because then I keep thinking it's obviously Friday tomorrow. And it's not. I did actually come in from school today and start having a really productive day. Shock horror. I know. I've done like 
all right i don't get how are you ever meant to hold punch off and know it's like in the center of the page because i never get it right i always get it proper off that will just have to do i normally no what um <laughs> what am i trying to say um oh i came in and started having a really productive day and then it just went downhill real quick and before i know it i spent like the whole evening on my phone doing nothing which is the story of my life is it not is so i'm gonna go finish off the last one of my plot lines i have some freeze tomorrow morning which is why i love a week thursdays they're my favorites um english character studies is the one thing you hear me complain about 24 7 because i hate doing them plot lines don't mind doing them character studies for each scene scene by scene actually hate it actually hate it um not enjoying english as much as i thought i would in case you can't tell anyway yeah, and then i need to go read and annotate this and it's already like i need to go do it and i need to stop procrastinating on my phone because i've just been posting instagram pictures and doing random crap that i didn't need to do if someone could tell me how to get my motivation back that would be greatly appreciated like majorly appreciated I haven't even got that much work and that's the point if i'd done all my work tonight that i had to do would have been fine wouldn't have had any work to do tomorrow night after school probably or like very little I'm going christmas shopping saturday <laughs> i know it seems like really amy like do you even have more christmas shopping to do but it's more so i'm going for a dad because dad is the hardest person to buy for ever 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 and also i'm going there for myself because mum and dad still are struggling with what to get me i say mum and dad dad and fee I feel like they come as one person like i just call them mum and dad no dad oh, oh gosh what am i saying um but yeah they all want more present ideas of what to get me so we're going shopping so that i can buy stuff and then obviously they give it to me for christmas well they buy stuff for me and like they give it to me for christmas you know what i mean i'm just talking crap aren't i i'm gonna go why am i doing this why am i filming this i don't know it is thursday morning i am not sure where the hell this week has gone if i'm honest I'm trying to figure out what the hell I'm going to wear today. I have no idea. But yeah, I have no idea where this week has gone. I'm so excited because I have just got in from school and the goods arrived. My pretty little thing order. They had, was it like 25% off everything? Something like that. So obviously it's coming up to Black Friday. So everywhere has got the deals going on. <laughs> So I'm very excited to try some of this stuff on. Um, if I, like obviously I will keep some of it. Um, so whatever I keep, I'll probably give some to mum. I'm so out of breath. Some to mum and some to dad and Fee to give me for Christmas. I don't like anything from Pretty Little Thing. Like, not one of the things I'm keeping. I just mean, like, you tell me what type of neckline is that. It just looks so weird. Like, oh, I've just wasted all my time trying all them on. I wasted my time even buying them, so I don't like any of them. <sighs> god um i thought it might be like one of the moments you know when you're trying stuff on but you're in a bit of a bad mood and that's why you don't like anything but no i like i really don't like anything can't edit the weekly vlog so that means that's not gonna go up at all because there's no way of me getting my hard drive and everything to do it i need to tidy up the absolute mess in my room from trying all this stuff on I need to package up send it back off gotta do that and now i've got to do school work for the rest of the night because i don't have the stuff i need to be able to edit the weekly vlog so i can't go to do school work instead and i was really looking forward to not doing school work tonight and one of the trousers that i liked this is just a joke didn't like them anyway they were too big they didn't fit around the waist started putting them on and the zip got stuck it wouldn't go up and it wouldn't go down and literally was stood there for a good 30 minutes in these trousers trying everything i even had to phone dad and be like sorry to bother you at work but how the hell do i get trousers off that are literally stuck i snapchat alice saying what am i meant to do because these trousers are stuck and she's just replying first of all let me say i love the trousers keep them that's how she get them off Extra help, someone to pull the zip down. I don't know, but I keep them because I'm loving them. <laughs> I quite like the striped thing. Mm, like it. That is like she made my day. Oh my gosh, hold up. Gonna need to reply to this now. Hello, so I've just got in. No, I haven't. I came straight in and got my pajamas on. I put my dressing gown on. V says she bought. Yeah, she bought, oh my god, my glasses is falling off my head. She bought cookies and I'm tempted, I am tempted. But I don't know if we have any left. Oh, oh, it's a big box. Maybe I'll have a Diet Coke with some ice in it, yes. We just had like two massive parcels arrive. 
So, oh gosh, that's a bit bright. God knows what they are. I think they're both addressed to dad. Maybe a Christmas present for me. Who knows? Um, one week, no, six days till 1st of December now. How exciting. Anyway, mum's got to be here any second. So we're about to go. We're going to go shopping. Girly shopping day. I am very excited. Lucy, can you repeat that story? No, <laughs> Please, I beg, I beg, I beg. I can't now, because it's Why? ephemeral. Just do it, just do it. We're, right, so we're talking about things. <laughs> We were talking about stupid things that Fia's done because someone just started shouting at their car window and we didn't know who they were shouting at. Fia was saying like, oh, we left something on the roof of the car anyway. So Fia started saying all these stories of like stupid things. <laughs> and she started not to tell the story. Driving along and it was early one morning and it was still dark. And um, some blokes started gesticulating wildly at me because I'd forgotten to put my lights on. But I just thought he was being rude, so I'm going to off. <laughs> <laughs> what did he do? I can't remember what he did. And then I realised what he meant and put me lights on. <laughs> so then he was like, oh my gosh, she's such an idiot. And you must have been well, so I don't know, because I'd driven down the road by that time. <laughs> <laughs> so what? <laughs> Oh my goodness, so I am home. Yay, I'm very, I'm not tired, but I was exhausted. We stopped for lunch and then we, so, oh right, I'll, I'll explain. So we stopped once for lunch. We then also stopped because we went into a jeweler's, we went into Beaver Brooks um, and we bought two things. And you know, like when it takes quite a while, you sit at a table and they like discuss all the options and stuff with you. And there was like, you know, you sit down. So we sat down then. And we also then went and got tea and cake and sat down again. We was freaking tired, okay? My arms were killing from carrying the bags and everything. Like, we have spent a lot today. Like, a hell of a lot of money. I don't know how much exactly. But, like, the productivity and the amount of Christmas presents we've got is insane. Dad and Fee have got me one of my, probably, probably my main Christmas present. Like, a big one anyway. It's just all good. Like, we've got so many presents. We've sorted out so many present ideas. You know, I said earlier, there's about two people that we really didn't have much for. One of them, well, they're two couples, actually. One of them, completely done now. Finished. Finito. All good. And the other, pretty much done. Pretty much. Is that dad that's home? Oh, yay, dad's home. So, dad's been out, so we haven't seen him. So, yeah, he's got two parcels here. I want to know what they are. But got something for myself in Breathe Bricks. I got some new earrings, like proper earrings I can wear every day for my first piercing. Um, so yeah, I'll show you them in a minute, but that's home, so I've gotta go speak to him. But literally, we've got so much stuff. We went for Nando's as well. Yes, and I'm really happy because we bought one of my Christmas presents today and I'm very excited. Yay. Oh, look how cute the little boxes. I don't know how we are gonna be able to see them. These are the earrings, they come in such a nice box. I don't know. They're like loads of little diamonds. They're really, really pretty. So yeah, I got them. Also, obviously I didn't get to watch Strictly because we was in Nando's. <laughs> Alice has texted me. She thought I'd watched it. But she said, apparently Morning and AJ got a nine. Which like, oh my gosh, because they wanted a nine. So I'm really happy about that. And apparently something happened where everyone wanted them to kiss. So I'm very excited about watching that. Like, what the hell? Oh my gosh, I really ship them. I'm not gonna lie. I've said, I've said that from day one. Like, they suit each other, okay? Also one negative thing we've lost i think 80 pounds <laughs> like it's just gone it was like in cash and it's just gone so that was mom's money and we have a search everywhere and we cannot figure out where that's gone which is a lot of money like to me anyway that's a lot of money <sighs> so that's brilliant but other than that i've been in really really good mood <laughs> the end of another weekly vlog i am so freaking tired work today actually killed me like i'm done doing more school work and trying to factorize stuff that i've just realized don't factor so freaking tired but we don't have school tomorrow got a good really exciting day tomorrow sorry that there was no weekly vlog up this week gonna try and resurrect that situation for next week i'm so tired i want to get in bed but I and it wouldn't be a true hello amy vlog if my camera battery doesn't die halfway through me talking therefore gonna end it on my phone thank you so much for watching if you did enjoy it give it a thumbs up I get to open that next week. How exciting. Um, yeah, it's 1st of December on Friday. Five days to go, including today. It's good. Very excited. Thank you so much for watching. I love you all lots. And I'll see you again in my next video. Bye.